my review of the Maypole 4 amp electronic smart charger. Um, I bought this to replace a rather old Halfords battery, car battery charger. Um, it does cars and motorcycles 6 or 12 volt. Uh, but <clears throat> it's probably about 30 years old. So the time has come to uh, upgrade. Plus this thing used to take ages. I think it's one amp charger. I'm not sure. Anyway, so smart charger is the way to go. Um, these can be particularly handy if you want to just um, this part here, seasonal battery maintenance, where it just does a low, very low trickle charge to keep the battery in a charged state. Um, maintenance charging. So yeah, um, this is uh, this is what I bought. They're twenty four pounds. Um, obviously, does everything really. Um, was it? It's got the um, capacity that it does. So I can't see it. Saw it somewhere. Oh yeah, there you go. One point two amp hours to one hundred and twenty. So that's probably a, a leisure battery that it would do a caravan or something like that. So yeah, here we go. Let's have a look. One hand is unboxing. What I'm going to do is uh, connect it up to a battery that I've got. Um, out of the car and just see what it gives you. So here we go. It's quite nice, quite robust, IP65 rated. Um, it's also got, by the looks of it, some sort of clip for hanging up. Yeah, there we go, it pulls out. So you can chuck it on a hook or somewhere under the car, bonnet, or something like that. Um, connector, um, different different types, that's quite nice. It's got inline fuses as well. So if you do put them the wrong way around, it will just blow the fuse. It will not um, screw the charger. So yeah, inline fuses. And also just this one way of connecting, so you can't get that wrong. It's also got a plug, a protector plug on the end to um, just protect the connectors. So these are the ones I'll be using. Um, those look like uh, terminal connectors. Okay. Let's have a Look at the instructions. Stop right, so just some safety, and then here we have it during the charging. As you during the charging, the LCD display backlight will be red when charging is finished, it will be turned green. Good. Because this, well, no idea. Um, I charge and it starts at three and it goes down to one, and I think, well, that's probably good enough, but you know, I've got no idea. Um, winter mode for 12 volt standard battery, 12 volt AGM batteries, suitable for five degrees or less, six volt standard lead battery mode, battery level indicator. Okay, various displays, possible faults, summary of operation. Um, okay, winter mode. There's quite a, a lot of detailed information on that sheet. Um, I'll just hover over it so you can have a little look and pause the video if you want to look at that. Um, that's your selection leads. Good. Connection, charging, charging's complete. 
switch off the main supply, unplug the charge and disconnect the clips and the battery. Negative black lead first. Good point. And then the red lead. So yeah, this is um this is a UK company, um Maple. Um based in some it is made in China, this, but um, yeah, Maypole Limited, Birmingham, UK. Um, that's their email address if you've got any questions about the uh, the charger. So let's um, let's get to my battery and um, let's uh, plug this in and see see what happens. Right here we go. So we plugged in. This is our battery that we're going to charge. Um, I was going to say, uh, I've connected the cables. Um, one thing I thought about as well, these are good. They're like um, the clip-ons, they're completely covered. Uh, so the metal's not exposed apart from there. But um, if you touch these, obviously, you're going to blow the inline fuse. So, um, yeah, something else to bear in mind. Um, let's have a look. I think what we'll do, let's look at the mode. No, I think we've got to connect it first. Right, let's go in um, negative first and a positive. So it's coming back as 13.2 volts. Um, 13.3, I think that might be the charging voltage, but I'm not sure. That's the indicator battery um, level indicator. So um, yeah, it's charging at the moment. Sometimes you can hear inside the battery. No, I can't hear anything. Does that then let us go into mode now and the battery's there? Yeah, it does. I'm guessing, I should have read this properly, but um, I'm guessing that it will, once charged, flick into trickle, so the, the charging voltage would drop. Um, by the way, that's the model number, MP7423. Let's go up to 14.2 volts. It's nearly charged. This should all go green once it's charged and I guess maybe this mode had changed the state sorry the, yeah the mode the charging mode had changed but we'll have a look at that fourteen point five I'm gonna wait because this is gonna take seconds to finish there you go. That's a bit odd because it's dropped down to two solid bars and one bar. Don't know. Maybe it just gets the status. That initial bit is the status. I'm going to have a look at the instructions now and just uh, check on that. All right, so just come back and it's showing fully charged. Oh, it's at least fully charged, but still orange. So it hasn't gone green. Looking at instructions. Done, it's charged. So, 
So that's interesting. It's got different. Um, so it detects what the voltage is. Um, if the voltage of more than 7.5 is detected, the charger is recognized as battery is 12 volt. The voltage of 7.5 volts to 10 volts is ground maintenance charge is activated. Okay. 0.8 amp pulse charging until voltage exceeds 10.5. If the voltage doesn't reach 10.5 volts within 30 minutes, a battery fault is indicated. And I'm charging until the voltage reaches 12.8. Everything yeah, then we'll check the battery voltage. Okay, 15 to 20 minutes it checks the voltage. If the voltage is not increased by the charger will increase the charging current by one amp to two amp. Cycle will be repeated every 15 to 20 minutes and charging current can be increased. It's pretty much you just plug it in, connect it and leave it. <laughs> but this is charged now so um, you can see the voltage actually starting to drop on the battery. It's, very, it's quite an old battery this, it's probably I don't know, four or five years old. So you should have a look at it really. Um, it has got, you can fill it up, um, that looks a bit dodgy so maybe i'll check those in a bit all right thanks for watching this is my um, unboxing and review of the maypole electronic smart charger for a mp7423 6 volt 12 volt it's a big thumbs up i think it's brilliant um so far uh, i'll probably test it on my ledger battery um later on to see see what that does okay thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe